Let's, uh, let's my, my favorite piece of yours, uh, and it's not poetry, it's no, comedy. No, it's stand-up it's stand now. Do that one joke. Do that one joke well, about wait, gay rights. Do you, uh, do you want to stand? Ron, would you like me to stand or sit? You or just, just sit right where okay. you are, so uh, you can't get away if it sucks. <laughs> sure. Uh, sure. To every heterosexual, mentally abusive, closet racist, fast food feeding, let your kid run around a mall like a psychopath parent, why do you have like nine fucking kids, yet you say that gay folk can't adopt because it might screw the child up, and I know. America thinks that every time a gay couple adopts a child, it forces otherwise straight and homophobic Pastor Ted Haggard to hire a gay male prostitute and engage in a week-long meth-induced fuck spree. I know. <laughs> he didn't want to do it to you guys, but then a gay couple adopted, and it forced him to take an injection of another male prostitute cock. I know. I get it. But I say just because your man bits fit into some girl bits doesn't mean you have to have kids. Do you know how many straight parents shouldn't have children? Go to a movie theater or an IHOP on a Sunday. <laughs> and don't tell us that two men or two women in the bedroom may cause a child to question his sexuality. Any kid basing his sex life on the sounds coming from his parents' bedroom is already fucked beyond repair. <laughs> if God designed marriage for a man and a woman, then statistics say that God is failing. That is below failing. Just look at otherwise straight and homophobic Pastor Ted Haggard, who's married with children, but hired a gay male prostitute to shame fist him into a meth coma. <laughs> but, but you say that being gay is immoral? Really? More immoral than shame fisting? Because I would rather have my kids being raised by the flaming queer couple down the street than have them spend another night at the church with father diddly hands. Is that why you want adoption restricted church? You keeping all the young ones for yourself? Church, if you really think that a child should only be raised by a married couple, then I have an idea. Let the gays marry, asshole. These are people who will raise a child for a better reason than the condom broke. You give me one valid argument besides, but God made Adam and Eve and not Adam and Steve. Really, because by the looks of it, Adam and Eve fucked up big time and maybe Adam should have explored other options. So stop fucking telling us that the Bible says that being gay is unnatural because I've read the Bible and there is a lot of unnatural shit that happens in that book. I would say that a dude dying than rising from the dead in a zombie-esque fashion is far less natural than me sucking a cock. Because at least cock sucking you can prove. <laughs> Wait a minute, I'd like for you to try it standing up. <laughs> <laughs>